Good morning lovers. Um, brew day today, it's uh, Sunday morning, uh, something like 7 o'clock. Uh, strike water's heating up. So, what are we at? Oh, we're nearly there actually, we'll make this quick. So, um, not really going to do a brew day footage or anything, you've seen all that before. Uh, but today, I've, I'm going to set up a tilt hydrometer for the first time. So this came this week, I've had a little play, not really sure I know what I'm doing, but um, anyway, let's have a play and see what, uh, see what happens. So um, very quickly, comes in a box, oh, that, that slides out of there, okay, and in there you have your tilt hydrometer. Don't forget to take it out of its protective little tube. So there it is. In all its glory. I've been booming and eyeing about whether to bother with this or not. So anyway, decided I'd give it a go. Oh, that's the top gone flying. So uh, in the pack comes this uh, handy little illustration of how it works and a quick start guide so but I'm not I'm gonna set it up uh, with brew father not to Google Sheets I think I think I can do that we'll see we'll see how it goes so it sounds like it's at the temperature so bit of brew porn not really is it it's just doing in mashing and all that stuff that we do every every time we brew um, and then at the end we'll look at how we set up the tilt hopefully I'm sure Graham is uh, really excited at the moment because he's always helping me out with little technical problems and he says I'm useless So, uh, dear. I might be on the phone. No, no, I won't be on the phone to you, Graham, because you've got a tilt. So, uh, Rusty, I might be on the phone to you later. All right. Okay. In the immortal words, Bing Bong. Catch you in a bit. Just done some recording without the uh, camcorder on record, so you've missed all the action. Okay, nice and quick. That's one. Uh, Pass. It's gone. Right, so brew day's over. Uh, you've seen the tilt go in the fermenter. So Sorry about the squeaky chair. Now then, let's uh, open up the Tilt app and it's going to search for nearby tilts. So there we are. So it's interesting, 10.15, I haven't even fermented yet. So uh, 10.48. So 
anyway let's I did um, calibrate it in cold water um, before I did this and then sanitized it in Starzan and then chucked it in the bucket so we press the settings button there's the tilt red one so first thing it does is ask for the beer name so that was the red brick rye and then save that so my Google email address there um, and then it says use device logging so more information enables login to this phone connection to Wi-Fi or cellular internet not required log file will be saved as CSV and can be emailed from this app for later viewing so there we are so use default cloud Earl so I'm not going to do that because I'm going to use it on the brew father so we need to get the Earl the brew father Earl so let's go to brew father so in brew father we go to settings scroll down tilt hydrometer so we enable that and then we got to copy this URL here copy back to tilt paste there it is and save it okay so got the message at the top to say that it's been saved so then we're going to go down oh where is it oh here we are right so start new log so that's that so that should be the tilt set up in the tilt app so now what we've got to do is go back to brew father and then go to the batch okay so we finish brewing and we're going to fermenting and we change status to fermenting yes so we've got the devices here can you see that here we go devices just there so what's in there I was just showing that it's enabled so so we've changed the status to fermenting we go so no regions found set up your device to the log cloud or we've done that then attach your device to this batch so this could take up to 15 minutes so make yourself a cup of tea let's go and have a look we we'll go in devices so it's not there yet so you should get a little box just here saying attach so it hasn't come up yet so go make yourself a cup of tea and uh, I'll be back in a minute alright so nothing happened I won't make myself a cup of tea nothing happened so I put a timer on uh, 13 minutes nothing happened so further down it says third party cloud login so I've pasted the Brewfather URL into there saved it gone back to Brewfather and instantly it was there so there we are attach so we press the attach and that's it so what do we do now what's in settings there 
Status ignored. What does that mean? So we can get rid of that, can we? We can clear that. Start a new login. Let's see what happens there. Celsius. Right, so interestingly, because uh, let's have a quick butchers, I can't remember what the specific gravity was. I don't know what that 1015 is. Rusty, if you know, let me you know, tell me. Um, Bashes. So brewing, we got ten forty seven is what we got actually. And it was ten thirty eight pre boil gravity. <coughs> so so it says 10.40, so I'll still be chucking a hydrometer in by this week, I think. So, now you've got to understand that when it comes to technology, I don't really have a clue. So, um, oh, look at that, here we go. Got the starts of a graph here. Oh, we're showing 1048 on there. SG Well, there you are, Rusty. Let me know what on earth is going on. So, hasn't started logging yet, but it says 1048, which is what I've inputted. Uh, there we are. So, there we are. Anyway, I think I need to do a bit more learning, uh, but that's, that's basically the tilt. Attached to the brew father. Attached to the brew father. I'll still chuck a hydrometer in till I'm happy with it. There we go. Anyway, thank you for watching, my lovers. Cheers, my dears. Take care. Drink plenty of beer. So, just a, a very quick update. Um, I've just come out to pour myself a another pour to it but um, unfortunately that was the last of the keg so but I was able to manually uh, adjust the specific gravity um, in the tilt app and so I've had it on in the shed in the brew shed um and i've been watching it in the house on uh, so the ipad has been in the shed and i've been watching it in the uh in the house so what was interesting was can you see that can you see how you can actually watch the temperature is is rising as the fermentation begins so we've all sort of heard that uh, fermentation generates heat and um, and there you can actually see it so that is, is really interesting to me and also 
So we're six, seven hours into fermentation. And if you can see it, we've gone from 10.48 to 10.41. So really good. So I'm quite excited about that actually. So um, um, uh, you know, apart from the, uh, well, I mean, it's the first time I've, I've used the tilt, so it's, it's getting getting to know what to do and all that. So, um, uh, but um, that's been really interesting for me. So uh, I just thought I'd uh, stick that on the video and. Um, Hopefully it'll be in interesting to you. So anyway, cheers, my dears. Bye for now. <laughs>